If you've been working in the 3D space for long enough, you'll know that there are a lot of 3D scanning apps, especially free ones. Unreal Engine just released the beta version of Reality Scan and we are testing it out. It's actually pretty great. This particular app was created with Quixel. All you have to do is download the app and scan a 3D object. Of course, there are certain types of objects that work better than others, and you can check out their documentation or follow the steps in the tutorial so you can tell which ones are the best types of models. And by default, it puts your 3D model in Sketchfab and gives you a temporary upgrade to a pro account. So if you're interested in checking out Sketchfab's pro features, that would be a great time to do it. Let's dive into it. So we wanted to pick something that had a little bit of a texture challenge just to see how it would perform. And it actually did a pretty decent job picking up the details on this dog toy. And because the shadows and the highlights are baked into the model, this worked out in our favor. Here we are making our rounds around the object and still photos are materializing in AR. You can see the different colors, red, yellow, and green. This is letting us know which pictures are working. Once pretty much it's all green squares, you're gonna go on to the crop section and this is where you're gonna limit your space. We kind of ran into a unique issue with the bear because it had a white space underneath its armpit and so it was really hard to crop that out. So unfortunately that shows in the final product, but overall, not bad. Once you are satisfied with the preview, then you can submit it and this will send it to process. It takes a little bit of time, so be patient, and then before you know it, you're gonna have a finished 3D model. And next, we're going to go to Sketchfab and download our model. As you can see here, I didn't do a great job scanning the underside of the bear, but that's my fault. I think the app would have captured that just fine. Let's see. Okay, we're gonna upload this to the Echo 3D console so we can view it in AR. And there's our finished model. So let's see this in AR. For reference, let's revisit the original photo. Let's scan it and take a look. Here is the final product. 